did you say? I, no matter. It's just this little wound. He is a cadet. Cadet of the guards. His name? Baru Christian What? He is not in the guards? Yes, since this morning. How quickly, quickly we lose our hearts. But why have you come here to tell me this? I do not understand the reason, madame. Ah, it is someone yesterday told me a shocking thing that in your company you are a Gascons, and that... And that we pick a fight with any young upstart who through favor gains admittance into our pure Gascon ranks. Is that what you heard? And can you see how I travel for him? Not without reason. But I thought you were so pretty kind. I thought if you only would, you would help me here. Tis well, I shall defend your pretty little baron. Just as I said. And you'll not let him fight or do it. I have promised. Oh, I love you so much. And I will do it. But you never told me about the bird in the One do when Gascons become a bit too boastful. Prove that one need not be a Gascon to be brave. Thank you. Cyrano, tell us your story. Yes, tell us your story, tell us your story, tell us your story. We want to hear it. My story. Oh, yes, gather round and I shall tell you. When I was all alone going to meet them. The light was dark, you could not see beyond your nose. Who is that man? A new recruit who arrived just this morning. This morning? Baron Christian de I damnation! You could not see, you could not see beyond your nose. Your face! Suddenly, I turned the corner and found myself lost and alone. Facing a hundred men who stank up the nose. Of wine and onions, I lowered my head and charged. All through the crowd. Someone hunted. Well, I answer. <laughs> the devil, leave this man to me. <laughs> Oh, my. 
almost the same. A cousin. She has told me all. She loves me. Perhaps. Sir, how happy I am to know you. This is what I call a sudden friendship. Forgive me. He truly is bad. Everyone knew, sir, how I admire you. Roxana waits in there to us. What is the matter? Roxanne will soon be here. I prepared the words to cover you with glory. Quickly, there's little time. No, eh? no I'll speak with my own words tonight. What kind of madness is this? Come, let me tell you. No, away from me. I am tired of pretense and of playing this role and of trembling in fear. I know quite well how to take a woman in my arms. She's here, Cyrano, don't leave me now. 
Speak for yourself, my friend. Until tomorrow, my friends, goodbye. We miss a discourse on love's passion. Tis you.
forgive me. I am not myself. It is so new for me. So new. So new. Ah, yes. To be sincere. Never before have you spoken to me like this. Yes, my heart is ever clothed in artful words. I rise to pluck a star from the heavens, but yet I fall and stoop in shame.
a certain house without fail. Please come back in an hour. Well then, this person will have to wait longer. I shall not let you go until the night has come. Perhaps I shall be called away a little sooner. The devil take that infernal tapestry, if you please. <laughs> I was waiting for you to say that. Oh, these four, they are the color of a nation yellow. How gracefully they fall. Regard them well. How short is their journey from branch to the earth. And yet... Their last flight is a thing of beauty, for in spite of their terror of meeting the earth, they give their flight the grace of a bird. Who are so sad tonight? No, not at all, Roxon. Well then, let's be done with the falling of leaves, and you shall tell me all that has happened this week. I can say Oh, yes. Sunday last, having eaten too many sweets at his dinner, the king was taken ill. After they had bled him, his illness was found guilty of high treason, and his pulse returned to normal again. Monsieur de Bergeron, the wind will hold in your tongue. Monday, nothing. As a new lover, oh. Tuesday, everyone went to fall and blow. Wednesday, La Monga turned the count of fiesta down. Thursday, Mancini was almost the queen of France. Friday, La Monga tore the count of fiesta. And Saturday, today, Cyrano, he's fainted. What? What is it? Leave me alone. 
it's only my old wound. You remember? Poor dear friend. It's nothing now. It's already gone. We both have our old wounds to bear. I have mine. Always thinking it is here. A wound that never heals. It is here, it is matter now yellowed with age. One can see his tears, his tears and his blood. His letter. Did you not promise me that one day, perhaps, you would allow me to read it? Ah, uh, do you wish his letter? Yes, I would tonight. Take it. You do not mind. Read it.
Finish my cassette. Saturday. Today. Monsieur de Bergerac was dirty's mortal blow. Oh, what have they done to you? By the blow of a sword, but my hero is to the heart. Yes, I would say that, but destiny mocked me. And I am about to die, struck from behind by a coward. It is well, I have missed all things, even my death. Oh! 